Hello, so welcome back to my channel. For today's hair sponsor is from the company Cryer Hair. Um, they sent over all these goodies and they also sent this beautiful, I believe it was a 24 inch wig. If you guys are interested in how I style this unit, then keep on watching this video. All right, y'all, so we're back. Let me know, do you guys like me to start my videos, well, my hair videos with my makeup already done or when I don't have my makeup done? I'm just curious because I don't know I feel like I kind of like it when I don't have my makeup on because the transformation be like I don't know a little bit more whoo but like when I have my makeup on like you know you guys already seen the full look if you guys get what I'm saying if you don't okay but you guys get what I'm saying but yeah we about to install this week I wish that I actually recorded me um you see her she moving um, I wish I actually recorded me straining it and stuff like that. I didn't. I didn't because I low-key kind of forgot like right after. Right after I finished. Right after I finished like, you know, flat iron. I'm like, damn, why didn't I record this so it could be part of the video? But. My, my straining i i mean i mm, i feel like i sh the strain is like a typical straighten video so there's nothing special about it but i know some people be curious on how you get your hair to be so you know silky straight and stuff like that but yeah i know y'all see me with the with the streaks this might be so freaking cute yeah i know when i see some bomb lace like i said i already know this install gonna be fire and y'all y'all know I only say that when I only say that when I see the lace is fire and this lace is fire. Okay, this is gonna mess up my brows, so I'm gonna quickly cut this off. Just so it don't mess up my brows because y'all know the drill. Let's quickly do our ear tabs. Boom boom boom. I am gonna use the gods to guys to be gots to be underneath now i would use the erica j glueless one i really do love this but i really don't want any residue on my hair because it does leave a little bit of residue even though it's easy to come out um i'm not trying to have any residue left over for me to have to be wiping down so i'm just gonna go in with my gots to be This is why I like putting these sprays because look, this junk is going everywhere. And then a boom. So normally I would just leave this on first and then cut off the lace, like finish all the parts, but I feel like taking off the lace now. So that's what we're doing. Did y'all say bless me? Y'all better have. Ooh, that almost took my spirit, Jesus. Y'all yeah, don't worry if most of this don't get sticked down because we're gonna go back in one more time so whatever is not like you know stuck down now will will get stuck down later So I'm gonna go one more time in my makeup. Do I need to use this one? Okay, I'm gonna put my hair up first. Uh-uh, where 
Where's my clip? Okay. take our tresemme hairspray i really do love this hairspray it's not like too too um it's not too too strong it's not too too flaky i don't know it just gets the job done but i'm gonna go around my whole perimeter yeah if you guys have makeup on please be careful because this part will have your makeup all types of jacked up if you're not <gasps> you see if you're not careful now my makeup gonna be looking so patchy it's gonna look fucking ridiculous. But. Mm, good thing I'm taking. <gasps> Y'all, my wig is coming the fuck up. Y'all got one job. Some hair tutorial this is. Anyways, if that ha ever happens, just go in. Just make sure you lay them somewhat in place and then take your, take your, um, take your headband and literally just lay it on top of it. Cause that's normally what I just do. Cause sometimes when you do go back in with the spray, your wig does, if you're not quick enough, you know, like quick enough to, you know, lay down your, um, your band, your lace will start like, you know, lifting, especially if you didn't put too, too much because I didn't put that much. So you really got to be quick or it'll start lifting. But if it does just honestly, just slap it back on top. That's exactly what I do. I just slap it back on, but I'm going to give it a few minutes. I'm going to give it a few minutes for it to, you know, marinate to get everything together and then after that we're gonna come back and you know style part you know get her cute all right you guys so i'm hoping the closure is still on well, the closure the front is still where it needs to be especially since it moved okay okay she's still cute i mean it could have been a little bit more in the front but She's good, she cute, she cute. Cause especially since I'm not really gonna be doing any baby hairs, I really honestly do not have to. And especially the way that I'm gonna be wearing it, so it doesn't really matter that it's pushed back a little bit. I'm gonna go ahead and fix my middle part real quick, hopefully. Yeah, this is the key to getting your middle part of me cause like I always suck at doing middle parts. You have to put the, the comb on your nose and then go ahead and just go in. Then we go in with our hot comb. Okay, so since th even though this isn't gonna have like no um like i don't really want it to have that frontal effect look i still want the front of my hair to be a little bit um to be lifted a little bit i think i know y'all know what i mean like when the when it's a little bit up like this you see what i i don't know if y'all can see that difference but all i all you need to do is go in with some spray Break her up real quick. Yeah, be careful with this because this shit will burn the hell out of you. Because even now. Oh. Y'all. Yeah. That shit is going to leave a mark. I know it's going to leave a mark. Like I said, yeah, I'm constantly burning myself. But whatever. Oh, that shit hurts. The ghetto. I jinxed myself. I should have never said anything. Hi, kid, y'all burnt me. Look, trying to be cute on the camera and shit. Ugh, this shit hurt. It's gonna stink so bad. Okay. Let me do that to the next side. Okay. Now I'm scared. Okay, I didn't burn myself, but the heat. 
from the fly. I be understanding why some people be scared of the um of the hot comb because this hockey be ow. She hockey be scary. You honestly just gotta thug it out because you're gonna get burned. If you if you do your hair, you're gonna get burned. I don't care. And then the last thing that we are going to do, because I already like went in and um and flyering it. I mean, I could go back in and flyering a little bit more, but it's not that deep. But what we're going to do now is actually fix our part. I want our part to be as crisp as possible. And y'all already know the drill. Yeah, I'm sorry about my little sister in the back. She here, she going through some. So I'm gonna go ahead and take Fawn. Fawn or is this Toffee? This is Toffee. Whichever one that's closest to your skin tone. I still never got the new, where did I put it? I never still got the new black spray because remember, I'm not sure if you guys watched my last video, but this spray, I really do not like it because the tip is different. Like this one, I, like this is different from the regular spray can and the tip is different. So it's a little bit harder for me to get like precise lines. I need to go back and get the other one, but I just never remember. And I don't know, for some reason I feel like it's not as dark as it needs to be. If I do have this, make sure you use it really far away because I was spraying way too much. And then I'm gonna seal it off with the Tresemme. And also this is gonna take care of any baby hairs that might be in like you know up and then boom like i said we're not doing any baby hairs because some installs really don't need baby hairs so yeah so i'm gonna go ahead and find a cute shirt to put on so i can come back and you know tell you guys the final deeds of this beautiful wig all right you guys we're back honestly i really could have just finished the video with my um robe on because all i did was put on a shirt but anyways but i mean it's a change of color so it is something different but anyways you guys this is the final look honestly this has to be one of the um best styles and also hair that i've you know had in a while because y'all do y'all see her let me do a little y'all see her this hair is from uni's hair and honestly guys i've worked with uni's hair so many times like so many times i work with them like so i already know how the quality is i already know they lace is gonna be bomb their hair quality is always up to par and even before when they were sponsoring me i used to buy uni's hair with my own money before that says a lot because their hair quality is still up to par if not better from how it was before but yeah i'm really in love with this style like this is so cute it's so cute and then what i also love is y'all know how i feel about strangly ends they already went in and actually um cut the strangly ends already so everything is all even and stuff like that which i really love it's like they was reading my freaking mind and everything is all even and everything let me know what you guys think about this color down below honestly if i really wanted to because the color go all the way from the side i can do like a little side thing and just have it this way which would be pretty cute also or if you guys want to do or you guys can do like a half up half down which would also look raw because it has the the blonde on the top as well there's so much different styles you can do with this hairstyle um with this style especially with the bleach in the front but personally, I honestly just love the way that it is. Like just like a a cute, a cute, simple, sleek, straight look. Like you can just never go wrong. But I'm really loving this. Like I'm probably gonna keep this on for a little bit because she's getting cute. Like, make sure you guys like this video. Um, all the information will be in the description bar down below about this unit. They're most likely having a back to school sale. So make sure you guys go ahead and check that um, description bar down below so you guys don't miss out on any sales. Again, this hair was sponsored or sent over to me by Eunice Hair. 
and yeah but if you guys enjoyed this video please make sure you guys like comment and subscribe we're on the road to 20k please make sure you guys are subscribed and i'll see you loves in my next video bye Back.